out their non-region schedules. The North Augusta Yellow Jackets and the Strom Thurmond Rebels are going head to head in our Under the Lights Game of the Week. News 12's Alyssa Lyons joins us live from North Augusta High School ahead of a game that should have the hive buzzing tonight. Dan, listen, I think I keep running into the same predicament every week. I'm on the field by myself at 530. Don't worry, though, just because I'm warming up the turf for all these players here. That's exactly what it is, right? Well, just from talking to some of the players tonight, there's more in store than just a game. There's been a lot of smack talk going on between these two teams, and rightfully so. If you remember, we started off our Under the Lights coverage right here at North Augusta, and since then, both these teams have learned a lot about each other. Part of that comes from both squads facing tough non-region schedules. Tonight is one of those. Strom is hoping to go for win number three in a row, while the Jackets are looking to rebound after last week's loss against Dutch Fork. Last year, the Jackets lost to the Rebs 13-7. to The Rebs 13 coming only in the third quarter. The Jackets put on seven in the fourth. While the Jackets are focusing on hushing the outside noise, the Rebs are dialing in on what they already have. we got to keep our, team, keep our team quiet. Can't have any personal fouls and other non-disciplinary issues, so... Just keep us, if we do that straight, we can be really good on the field. Can't, you can't focus on just this week. You can't start looking ahead. It's, you got to go get better today. And if you can stack those good days on good days on good days, you got a chance to be special in the end. Now, if you've been following these two teams as closely as we have, you know that they're both impressive in their own right. This game is going to be won depending on defense and how Corey Tillman's offense will be able to manage the Rebs' defense. That's all new coming up at 6 o'clock. Thank you, Alyssa. The Jackets haven't played at home since week one, and they'll certainly have their hands full with the Rebels tonight. Do 